We now know the cause of death of a woman found dead near a Birmingham road. That woman, the victim of a dog attack. Good evening, I'm Pam Huff. And I'm Muriel Bailey. She was found Thursday morning in the 200 block of 18th Street in Inslee. The Jefferson County Coroner identified her as 63-year-old Sharon K. Billups Portis. ABC 3340's Valerie Bell joins us now. And Valerie, this attack has some people on high alert right now. Muriel, one woman I spoke with tells me she is taking extra steps to protect herself while walking after hearing what happened. She's now carrying a club. Billups Portis is well known in the community there by the nickname Brick. Some people say they would like to see something done to address the problem with loose and stray dogs so this doesn't happen to anyone else. You, you, you be According to the Jefferson County Coroner, Sharon K. Billups Portis was found laying in the grass on 18th Street, Ensley, next to her bicycle. People we spoke to say she rode often. Every day. That was her transportation. Willie Pace had known her for 40 years. Worked with her. We ate together. We just friends, you know. It was going to be a, you know, big blow to the neighborhood because everybody, you know, she got along with everybody. The autopsy revealed she sustained injuries from a dog attack. And people say it could happen to anyone. A lot of people walk around here with sticks, you know, in their hands or something like that, you know. A lot of them just don't even come out no more. Ronnie McKinnon has lived here for more than 20 years and says it's become a problem. It's a lot of loose dogs, you know. It's a lot of stray dogs in my community. We even saw a few of those dogs for ourselves. You can walk up and down the street and you'll see some. They might have started barking at you. Birmingham's Department of Public Works manages animal control. The mayor's office says it's unlawful for anyone to allow their pets to roam city streets. Anyone who sees a stray should call 311 or 911 if it's an emergency. Birmingham City Council members extended condolences to the family of Billups Portis. They add this is something that simply should not happen. We are going to be working with city leadership and partner organizations to figure out what can be done to prevent future tragedies like this whether that's through new legislative measures or bolstering existing leash laws. Muriel. And Valerie Bell reporting.